is, ladies and gentlemen, this is the new Julian Crane M3. The lightest, most portable and powerful gimbal for your smartphone, action cameras, point and shoot cameras as well as mirrorless cameras. And I'm not only talking about small Sony Alpha cameras, I'm talking about putting a juicy Sony a7S III on this bad boy. Okay, let's talk about it a bit. Not only did the Crane M3 come out of nowhere, but Julian also made sure to make this the simplest and most straightforward gimbal they have ever created. All modes can be accessed either through the touchscreen or by pressing the M button. Changing the gimbal settings is super easy. Just tap on parameters, change the motor torque, smoothness, deadband, and you're pretty much good to go. And yeah, I mean it, you're pretty much done setting up. Now, when I first got this gimbal, I was expecting it to handle a phone and my Sony Alpha 6500 at best. But I was super shocked to find out that not only it can handle my Sony a7S III, but I can also put the majority of my lenses on it. Viltrox 24mm 1.8, Sony 35mm, Sony 85mm, and even Tamron 17-28mm 2.8 lens. The only lens I wasn't able to properly use for my collection was the Tamron 28-75mm 2.8 lens because it was a little bit too front heavy. But anyway, let's just talk about the details of this crazy little thing. The design of the M3 looks incredible, it looks and feels well built, feels nice even in my huge European hand, I love that the M3 text lights up when it's turned on, you can use wired professional microphones because it has a 6.5mm audio port, 8 hour battery life and weighs only 730 grams. I mean, come on, you gotta admit, the design on this thing is solid. Balancing my setup wasn't as easy as it is on the Weeble series. However, after a bit of practice, I was able to constantly balance it in less than two minutes. It's all about the micro adjustments here. But I know the majority of you came here to see the performance, so let's show you some dope clips I managed to get while using this gimbal. This is such a fantastic gimbal for mirrorless camera users. While I do believe it is smarter to grab yourself something bigger and more powerful if you're rocking a full frame mirrorless camera like the Sony a7S III, Sony a7 III, IV, or something like that, you can still use these cameras if you have some light primes and zooms in your collection. However, if you primarily shoot with the Sony Alpha 6000 series or other light mirrorless cameras, man, you're gonna love this gimbal. It can handle Sony Alpha 6500 with Tamron 28 to 75 mm lens with an ease. So if you're a filmmaker who loves light setups, a vlogger perhaps, a YouTuber, someone who doesn't like when heavy tech gets in the way of creating your stories, the Julian Crane M3 is definitely going to be something you want to check out. You know, I love it when companies get out of their comfort zone to create something completely different and unique. And in my opinion, Julian has definitely done it this time. So the main reason why I think the Julian Crane M3 is truly a game changer is because finally, we can say that we have a gimbal which is powerful, can handle bigger mirrorless cameras and at the same time is super travel friendly. Anyway, it was really nice catching up to you guys. Uh, haven't seen you in a long time actually. I'm Gundar Smagun, one of the Julian YouTube hosts and hopefully you had an awesome day today. If you have a little bit of time, please subscribe to Julian's YouTube channel and maybe even check out my main channel which is Dream Door Films. You know the drill. Peace out.